What's happening, everybody? Bone back here with Real Breaks, ready to jump into 2021 Series 2, number 15 Jumbo Case. Got two cases in front of me here. I'm going to need somebody to pick either left or right. We'll get rocking on this one. Before we start the ripping on this one, I do have to run one random here quick. It's for the last break of the night. It's for our uh, Prism Draft Picks break that's happening right after this one at 11.30. Following that, we got a personal case of tribute. Nick Sartell is going to be battling his mom in uh, a case of battle. AL versus NL on that one. So, I'm waiting for somebody to pick either left or right. We're going right. Perfect. Love it. Thank you, Joshua. <laughs> Joshua's got your back, Lindsay. That's okay. I never like to pick either. Whenever I did pick, I always went right. Just just throwing that out there. All right, let me switch you guys over to my desktop here quick. All right, so Prism uh, Collegiate Draft Picks number two. Josh in the top three spots. Michael Cruz closes us out in the 32 spot. Team list looks like this. Niners through Washington. Any uh, penny points or anything like that will be random to all at the end of the break. So here we go. Dice rolling this has to be four or higher. Four, go on the bare minimum. Let's do it. And you got Jimmy up on top with the Niners and Jimmy on the bottom with the Washington football team. So there you go, my friends. There is your team assignments for Prism Draft Picks. I'll get that copy and paste on over into the break thread right away. P please PM me any transactions that you might have. I had one message sent to me about a trade in this uh, in this break here. So if anybody does have a trade, please make sure to send me a PM on that. All right, there we go. We are good to go for the night. Let's get after it. List back over. My mouse go. There's my mouse. All right. Let's do it. All right. Who's all hanging out with us tonight? Quarter to 11 o'clock on a Friday night here, Central Time. Yep, I got the 1 p.m. That was about uh, the Brewers and the Tigers. Chat's not working on the side for Facebook again. Gonna have to get a little creative so I can see who's talking. There you go. Joe Hill is in the house. What's happening, Joe? And there we have it. Now I can see the chat again. All right. Let's get a number one here. Yep. So, Tim, I got you down for the uh, Brewers now. And then I got Tony down for the Tigers. All right. So, what we got in here? Two silver packs. Save those for the end. Also in here... A little bit weird, but they're loose cards, and they are your box toppers, and they are chrome refractors. We'll get both of those sleeved up. Piazza for the Mets and Bogarts for the Red Sox are your two chrome box toppers in this one. Need some luck? Well, let's see if we can bring you some luck. Yeah, it is a little weird, isn't it, that they uh, that they aren't like in anything? They're just. They're just open. They're just open. They're just hanging out out there. From what I've seen so far, though, is they've been in pretty good shape. Haven't noticed any, uh, you know, dinged up corners or anything crazy like that. So maybe being tucked between two different packs, they've uh, been protected pretty well. So let's take you through one. Yeah, it might have been an afterthought. Let's take you through one pack to kind of show what we're going to do. So a jumbo pack, you know, looks like this. The good stuff is sandwiched in the middle. So when we're going through this, we're going to 
breeze right past the base, get to the good stuff in the middle. All the foils will all get sleeved up before they get shipped. Just chilling on a Friday night. I got a little country on that one for you guys. A little country on that. On that little jingle there. A little southern twang. I don't even like country music, but that's what you got. That's what you're getting. I heard that all those uh, those box toppers, they are n you can't get any autographs and you can't get any parallels of them is what I heard, but they are pretty darn cool. All right, last case of series two for the night. Let's make it a good one. Pavin Smith out of 2021 rookie. Got Alex Cobb and Jared Oliva for the Pirates. Is your first hit of the break. The Pittsburgh Pirates on that. Go to Jeff Gillespie. There you go, Jeff. Jeff is starting us off with the first hit of the break. A little Jazz Chisholm. I want to get a monster in this one. We had, I, I pulled one reverence so far, and I would love to pull another one. Brousseau out of 199 and Nick Madrigal for the White Sox. A little fun fact, Nick Madrigal drafted higher than Jared Kelnick in the draft. Get that Brousseau sleeved up. Ball Freddy. Let's see a relic coming here. Yelich, blue, and how about a Cabrian Hayes black numbered one or uh, one ninety five of one ninety nine for the Pittsburgh Pirates. Pirates off to a nice start in this case. Anybody else see Cabrian Hayes miss first base? I couldn't believe that. Yeah, in the last case, we pulled a rainbow foil Kirloff, and then also a um, Kirloff auto was in the first case. So both cases that we've had so far had really nice Kirloff stuff in it. Kirloff's been a good one. Yeah, auto in the first one that I did. In number 10, and then in number 11, it was a gold foil that we had. Jose Altuve is your short print. Go to the Astros. Astros, the Keith. I think I see a little buzzer right there. <laughs> Zach Birdie for the foil and Aaron Nola out of 99 vintage stock. Phillies. Tom Hulk. Have you pulled any nice Kirloffs yet, Andrew? Have you opened any uh, Series 2 yet? Anybody open any personal boxes of Series 2? Jonathan Stever on the foil. Chavis. Schwarber is your home run challenge card. That dude hits bombs. I must admit, I kind of like Kyle Schwarber a little bit more now that uh, he's not a cub anymore.
Get into box number two. On which card? On the showcase or when I'm going through them? I'll try to tilt them down a little bit more. As I'm going through them. I had to make my, uh, my reach stream kind of small so I could see. Lincecum to the Giants. Yeah, I can definitely try to hold them down a little bit further for you. Glass now. For the Rays. See a little bit bigger. There. Let's do it like that. Get on the box too. Couple more weeks, we shouldn't have to. Uh, yeah, those white boxes really kind of reflected, kind of. Let's try to put it down over there. Okay, I can still see it up in the other camera. Couple more weeks, we should be upstairs. We won't have to worry about the glare anymore. This room is very, very temporary. Very temporary room. Alright, here we go on box number two. Andy Young and Jojo Romero, Blake Taylor for the Astros is your autograph. Astros to Keith. Right on top there, Dylan Carlson. This one there. <laughs> Is it better that I uh, am tilting them down a little bit more? It's a struggle that we've been having in this room, trying to make it work the best that we can. Because the lighting wasn't great in these rooms, then we got new lighting, and then the lighting was uh, was too much. Short print, Johnny Bench for the Reds. Let's hit Reds going to Joey. No, that Carlson is kind of nice, isn't it? Four four one. I we haven't. I don't know if we've seen a super shorty yet at all. Did Amel pull any super shorties today? Or is it all normal? And by normal, I mean just your normal short prints. Lee Castro Gold Cup. Nick Markakis. Foil. Gloves are hats. All right. Relic. Ryan Mountcastle to the Orioles. The O's to John. 
It's definitely Ryan's fault, for sure. 100%. 100%. At least you know that it's Ryan's fault. We're good friends, then. <laughs> the only thing better you could have said was it's Tom's fault. Foil of Tommy LaStella. Oh, yeah, yeah. Absolutely, Lindsay. I like these rookie patches. Tops, Tops has a very, like, slick-looking rookie card logo. So I really appreciate um, the way it looks. I like the ones from Series 1, too. The, the team patches. Those were nice as well. Shogo. Hosmer out of, what was that, 499? Yep, 499. Padres. There you go, Bradley. Kimbrel foil cubbies. Clark Schmidt on the rookie foil, followed by George Springer. Ryan Weathers, Mike Trout home run challenge. There you go, Lindsay. Yastrzemski. That'll do it for box two. Oh, nice boxes. Step up the auto game a little bit and we're good to go. What is Trout's timetable to come back? Anybody know? That's the first time I've seen a double up from our box stoppers. Big Mac for the A's. Oh, I want a burger. Early July. Good, good. 2022. <laughs> oh, I hope not, Ryan. Man, the Home Run Derby is going to be incredible this year. With it being in Colorado. Oh. That's going to be sweet. wonder who the Home Run Derby... Participants are gonna be so they gotta be starting to discuss that by now. I'm thinking Vlad Jr. is gonna be in it again. Oh, Otani would be sweet to watch. Let's get a list going. Who? Uh, what do we? What do we think? Who's on your uh, your wish list? Who's on your wish list to be in the home run derby? You think, uh, well, you mean like in prices he's only going to go down from here? Or you mean like as uh, as a player he's he's kind of reached his peak? Seventy out of seventy, we got a platinum seventieth anniversary coming up. Matthias rookie Lance McCullers out of three hundred on the advanced stats. Trout Otani will be sweet. Oh, with production? Yeah. At the same time, though, Trout is always going to have value in the hobby. That's 
Gonna happen. This is number 51 of 70 on the CC Sabathia. Just, yeah, just because he can't stay on the field. Yeah, he's got, like, that's a weird thing about this year in baseball in general is people don't think, or uh, people just aren't staying healthy at all. Everybody is hurt. You know, there's a million relief pitchers that are hurt too. Tom Hatch. Little Wade Boggs short print. Bugsy. Red Sox to Matthew. Nice little hit, Matthew. It's a really weird year. And uh, I have a little friendly bet going on with a couple of my buddies about who's going to win uh, MVP this year for the AL. I said, and this is at the beginning of the year, I said Otani. Definitely not Gary Sanchez out of 499. Joey Bart to the Giants is your relic. Otani was my pick at the beginning of the year to win the MVP. Yeah, it all ties in, I think, with a lot of it, a lot of last year. I think it all ties in a lot with uh, with COVID last year, not being able to to train like you should be able to. I also kind of wish that a lot of the guys would have taken it upon themselves to keep themselves in tip-top shape where they're not going to be in uh, any harm of getting injured more easily, I guess. I'm not sure what the what the Minnesota boys have going on tomorrow, Johnny. I'll, pr I'll definitely have some on Sunday. I'll, uh, I'll definitely have some on Sunday. I don't know what, what Titus has planned for tomorrow. Corey Seager blew to the Dodgers. I think Titus has more golf going on tomorrow. Yeah, and that's what I said. If Otani can stay healthy, dude's going to win MVP. If he can have a sub-3 ERA, hit about 280 and mash about 25 home runs, I don't know how you can't give it to him, right? Ooh, Yankees, Alfonso Soriano. Oh, that's awesome, Rob. That's such a cool card, man. One seventy-two of one ninety-nine, Alfonso Soriano. Oh, that's awesome. Nine box jumbo. What? Tomorrow? Now you're gonna make me scroll up to the top. He is doing a nine case pick your team. Oh my goodness. Wow. Either uh it's gotta be either him or Amel that are gonna be ripping that. Crazy kids, I tell ya. That's a that's nuts. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, we'll definitely have some more. I would say a Sunday. Definitely have some more. Rourke. Tucker Davidson. I love that Soriano. I really do. So it'll be a mix of Jumbo and Hobby. So nine case break. Crazy, crazy, crazy. So Lair. I wouldn't be able to sit that long. The five case breaks are long enough. That'll do it for number three. We're going on. Going on to number five. I'm trying to think. 
think I, I think I only did a three caser up in Minnesota. A Piazza, we're doubling up on some of our box toppers in this case. Lincecum. So Otani, Vladdy. Who else? I'm, I keep going back to thinking about who should be in the home run derby. Like, I know he's not doing great, neither is the team, but I, I'd love to see Judge in a home run derby. Tatis? I thought Tatis, too, would be really fun to watch. Tatis would be cool. Acuna would be really fun to watch. I mean, we could do... Like Otani, Tatis, Vlad, Acuna, Judge. Someone mentioned Halloween handles. Yeah, I think it's uh, trick or treating. Buxton would be would be kind of cool to watch. I, I could get a bar with Buxton. No Cubs. If anybody says any Cub, banned. Banned from. You're banned from commenting. You can definitely donate them. Yeah, we're on we're on the same page on, a, on a, quite a few of these here, Keith. I want a couple other ones though. Alright, here we go, box four. McKinstry. Fam and Polanco. Jemiah Jones out of two ninety nine. Oh yeah, Jesse Winker's been been mashing the ball. I, I'll give you Jesse Winker. I'm straight crushing it. One more. Who's our last guy? Because I think that gives us. I think that gives us eight. Frazier. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Trey Mancini? Oh, Ryan Castellani. For the Rockies. The Rockies are going with Michael Jacobs. Let Mad Bum go swinging in a home run derby. Oh, okay. If they would do a pitcher home run derby, I would lift the no cub rule just so you could see Carlos Zambrano back up there. That dude loved to mash. Dude absolutely was a monster to watch hit. And uh, who was that other one? Mike Hampton, I think it was, was the other one. Blue, Mike Schmidt. Yep, Andrew just said Mike Hampton. <laughs> That's the second time I said something right as somebody was writing a comment. That's awesome. Mike Hampton would be a good one. Even though I don't like the Red Sox, maybe Devers. These die cuts are not fun to try to get in the sleeves. Yeah, he loves to bat. I might, I might have to go a little Homer. I like. Uh, Woodruff has a batter too. Shed Long, Jose Leclerc, a four ninety nine, and Braylon Marquez to the Cubbies. Oh yeah, they'd have to put somebody in the home run derby from uh, the hometown for the hometown crowd, right? As long as he's healthy, I think he'd be a good choice too. If he's healthy. Because he just got back from injury. 
Are you sure you just got back? Don't want to get hurt again. Oh, Bartolo. Yeah. Ryan, do you play the show at all? Luis Alexander Vasavi. Oh, Randy Johnson would be kind of fun to watch bat. That's how lanky he is. Kluber is a Vladdy home run challenge. Speak of the devil. Yeah, you. Bryant. Ooh, Sam Huff short print. Nice one for the Rangers. There you go, Keith. Nice hit. It's a great hit. I'm gonna bump the Mount Castle for it. Nationals, Juan Soto relic. Yeah, just because uh, talking about Mad Bum hitting and stuff got me thinking that, uh, like on the show, he's a, he's actually really really good to bat with on the show. And just he's saying that, uh, yeah, you Ryan Price. Yep, you Ryan. It's because uh, just uh, like when you said having Madison Bumgarner as the like the best hitter over anybody else, over any other pitcher. I don't know why that just reminded me of uh, of playing on the show because he is by far the best hitting pitcher on that game. He's incredible. number five we're going into. A couple nice ones for our box toppers in here. Oh, we got a bonus one too. We got three of them. And they're all rookies as well. That's awesome. Doll back to the Red Sox to Matthew. First time seeing this card, Alex Kirloff. Oh, nice. There you go. Got to go hit some dingers with uh, with Madison Bumgarner in the Diamond Dynasty. And Stevenson for the Reds going to Joey. Take a little bonus box topper out of that one. Excellent, excellent, excellent. We have two boxes left. I'm gonna get something big. Maybe a, maybe a trout auto. I'm thinking trout auto out of the silver pack. Would that be asking too much? Hey, yo, Nick. Good stuff. Trout auto from a silver pack. It is really hard to get used to. I tried turning off uh, crossplay because I play on Xbox. Anytime you get matched up with anybody that plays PlayStation, it's over, man. It's over. They've been playing the show for about six years, seven years, eight years longer than you have. It's over. Don't even try. I just do a lot of offline stuff. Some bowls, like cereal bowls? Like eating a bowl of Lucky Charms bowls? Box number five. Kelly 
Bradley Jansen. Freeland, how a little moose. Mike Moustakis. Gold out of 50. 40 of 50 for the Reds going to Joey. Nice hit, Joey. That's awesome. That is awesome. It's Alfonso Soriano. Luke, how cool is that? Burns. Teddy Ball Game. That's a cool one. Four four one. I like this card though. It almost looks like it's almost painted. It's a really nice looking card. Red Sox with another shorty. It was a Conseco with the World Series ring from 1989. I forgot Jose Conseco was a World Series champion. Also going to Joey. Yeah, just do uh, just do the offline stuff. It's it's so much better. I think I've only played like 19 games online. That's all I've done. Sandy Alcantara. You got an autograph ball of Soriano? That's awesome. I, I said after I pulled that card, I'm like, I gotta go on eBay and find one of these now. Because it's, it's, it's a really cool looking card. Michael, not, not right now. I thought about maybe doing another one of these, but by the time I get done tonight, Rubaker. By the time I get done tonight, it's already going to be 1.30. Because I, uh, I got a personal case at 12.30 tonight. Pete Alonzo for the New York Metropolitans. I'm going to say Mets going to Tony. A Fraud's Shadow. A Rod wishes he was as good as Alfonso Soriano. Here's a trivia question for you. I don't know if we asked this one before. I don't know if we've asked this one before. Maybe we have. I'm going to ask it anyways. Alright, so. Four, four players in MLB history, Luis Arias, four players in MLB history have are, are in the 40-40 club. 40 home runs, 40 steals in the season. Who is the only player of the four to not be linked with steroids? There's four players in the 40-40 club. Three of them are linked to steroids. One is not. Frank Thomas. Just do 40 for 24 hours straight of tops. I know, right? Wouldn't that be fun? Nope, not Miggy. 40 home runs, 40 steals in a season. Not pools. Yeah, Otani is so much fun to watch. He's he's insane. Oh, Marsho. So it's not Miggy, not Pools. Anybody else got a guess? The only player to ever get 40 steals and 40 home runs in a season, in the same season that is, in the same season, and not be linked to steroids. Not Griffey, not Tory Hunter, Nolan Arenado. George Foster? No, not George Foster. George Foster was a beast, though. Luke Johnson's got it. It was right in the money, man. Alfonso Soriano is the only player 
It's the only player. Yep, Michael Snow got it too. Eric Davis is a good guess as well. Alfonso Soriano is the only player in the 4040 club to not be linked with steroids. <laughs> good one. Well, three stacks back. Michael, you're funny. <laughs> I opened, uh, I got those open. David Wright, you're funny, Michael. Yep, it was Soriano. Michael's just messing with me. <laughs> Don't listen to Michael. Ortiz. How many breaks left? We got this one and another one, Nick. You met Alfonso Soriano? That's awesome. No, Bagwell never had uh, 40 steals in a season. Yeah, there's Fast Simul Autos. Our auto in that case was number, uh, was Mike Moustakis. The Moose. Because our autos so far are Castellani, Taylor, Moustakis, Soriano, and Jared Oliva. a good little trivia question, isn't it, though? Where did you meet Alfonso Soriano, Luke? That's why you think you're seeing autos everywhere, Michael. <laughs> Anyone, anybody would be seeing autos at that point. All right, last box before we get into our uh, silver packs. Stevie Ciszek. Looks like we got a Mother's Day pink coming up here. Hicks and Ben Bramer. Washington Nationals, Ben Bramer. First time seeing that guy's auto. Nationals to Joe Hill. Looks like BB2. BB2. Second shot, honestly, uh, for me, it didn't hurt as much as the first. You met him at the airport? That's awesome. You know, I always go to the airport and I'm always like, oh, I hope I see somebody famous. I never see anybody famous. And I always hear people talking about seeing famous people. I'm just jealous, man. Never see anybody famous. Houston Astros, Mother's Day pink out of 50. Astros going to Keith. <laughs> Ryan, could you hear that in my voice when I said that? Brian, Ben, Brain, Bramer? 2 of 50 on the Astros team card. I was trying to not let it uh, be so obvious that I also was saying, who is that guy? You met Andy Pettit too? Dale Earnhardt and Walter Payton. I can see Dale Earnhardt being really nice, honestly. And I can see Walter Payton being really nice, too. Here, not a home run challenge. Looking for a relic still. Relic? Your manufactured relic and also your regular relic, I believe, we're still looking for in this one. <laughs> That's right, Joe. Yes, it is. But you know the thing about 
like no name autos that you get in uh, flagship sometimes. We were saying that like who the heck is this guy? We were saying that same thing. Nice little Frank Thomas short print. We were saying the same thing about Yerman Mercedes in Series 1. Who the heck is Yerman Mercedes? I like this Frank Thomas. That's a really nice looking card. White Sox to Ryan Price. There you go, Ryan. Some people just had that kind of stuff there, Michael. Just, I don't know. They're just, like, they're almost too good for this world. Like, like we don't deserve them. As weird as that sounds. We just get a Brian Hayes short print, too. Two short prints in one box. How about that? Brian Hayes to the Pirates going to Jeff Gillespie. How about it? How about it? And Joey Bart is your uh, rookie card patch. Sweetness. Where'd you meet him at, Michael? I wish it was an SSSSSSSP. It's uh, it's just your regular four four one, so just your base short print. I wish it was a shorter 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 shorty. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna go with shorter shorty. It's still really cool. You Darvish, Wade Miley. Last little stack here. We got our last relic coming. Vladdy Jr. out of 199 is your last hit. Super Bowl in Phoenix? There you go. Denny McLean came to talk to you? I'm trying to picture Denny McLean. I'm sorry, I don't know who Denny McLean is. <laughs> There's Vladdy for the Blue Jays to Joshua. Out of 199, 135 of 199. He went to prison a couple times? <laughs> Why did he come and talk to you guys then? <laughs> he went to prison a couple times. Good old Denny McLean. Alright, let's do our silver packs. 12 silver packs here. We'll do six here right away. Oh, okay, Tiger's pitcher from back in the day. Tony Dorsett, uh, Cowboys running back, right? I like that, Lindsay. He went to prison a couple times. <laughs> really? Going to prison isn't good, right? <laughs> oh, my word. Mickey Maniac to the Phillies. Luis Garcia, purple. That's it there. Joe Adele. Tariq Scooble. Let's get an auto out of here. Come on. Bichette and Clark Schmidt for the Yankees. 19 of 75. So two purples so far out of our silvers. Nice Joe Adele for the Angels. He went before and after. Where am I going with this? I don't know where I'm going with this. Let's do that right there.
<laughs> That's funny, Michael. So what you're saying, Lindsay, is he should have taken his own advice. Don't go to prison, okay? Prison's bad, okay? <laughs> little Jake Cronenworth rook. There's a Mike Trout. Yeah, I'll definitely Google him tonight. Denny McLean. I got it memorized. I got it remembered. Let's do our last six. Come on, one auto. Give us one. You still have it or, or uh, she still has it? Elementary school, so it's kind of hard to remember. You Darvish out of 150. We got orange. Come on, be an auto. It is an auto. It is an auto. What do we got? I'm gonna hold on to that one for a sec. Shirt and apostle. Come on. Come on. Dodgers auto. Trevor Bauer. For the Dodgers Orange Auto. There you go, Dodgers. Who's got them Dodgers? Joey's got them Dodgers. I did, Luke. That was a sweet little card there. I want a Trevor Bauer. 12 of 25. We asked for one. We got one. Hey, you, you bought the Packers in the next break? All right, sounds good. Yeah, as long as I got a PM, we're going to be good to go. Little you Darvish. Can we get one more? Should we be greedy and ask for one more auto? You betcha we should be. Dylan Carlson. Come on, one more auto. Campusano. I don't think it's going to happen. Nope, not going to happen. Titus and Orange Bauer, too? <laughs> We're, we're buddies. We're, we're partners. We're like the Tiger Woods and his daddy. There we go. All right, my friends. That'll do it for the break. Let's do a recap. Start off with our box toppers. Ortiz, Red Sox, right, Mets, Stevenson, Reds, Kirloff, Twins, Dahlbeck, Red Sox, Lincecum, Giants, Piazza, Mets, Big Mac, A's, Bogarts, Red Sox, Glassnow, Rays, Lincecum, Giants, Bogarts, Red Sox, Piazza, Mets. let do short prints. Short prints. We got... Johnny Bench to the Reds, as well as El Tuve for the Astros. The Big Hurt to the White Sox. Ted Williams, Red Sox, as well as Wade Boggs to the Red Sox. We got two more short prints up on the showcase as well. Seven short prints in that box, in that case that we just had. It's fantastic. All right. Uh, parallels, including the Silver Pack stuff. Carlson, Cardinals, Darvish, Padres, Trout, Angels, Garcia, Nationals, Adele, Angels, Clark Schmidt, Yankees, uh, Alton Jolta, Simmons, Twins, Astros, Team Card uh, out of 50, Mother's Day Pink, Thomas, White Sox, Arias, Crew, Brubaker, Pirates, Leclerc, Rangers, Schmidt, Phillies, Jermaine Jones, O's, Seeger, Dodgers, Sanchez, Yanks, McCullers, it's out of 300. Astros, Hosmer, Padres, um, Blue Jays, gloves are hats <laughs> to the Blue Jays. Uh, Nola, Vintage Sock, Phillies, Yelich, Crew, and Brousseau to the Rays. Gloves are hats. 
do some relics. Throw our landscape first. Sabathia, that one's out of 70 for the Yankees. 51 of 70. Mountcastle owes Soto. Nationals, Canseco. Athletics. Verticals, we got Nick Madrigal, White Sox, Bart, Giants, Marquez, Cubs, Carlson, Cardinals, Alonzo, Mets, Joey Bart, Giants, and Vladdy out of 199. Blue Jays, 135 of 199 on that one. Autos. Ben Bramer to the Nationals, Ryan Castellani, Rockies, and Blake Taylor, Astros. Showcase time. We'll start over on the right-hand side. Sam Huff, short print. Go to the Rangers to Keith. Nice hit, Keith. How about a Trevor Bauer orange auto from the Silver Packs? Numbered 12 of 25. Dodgers to Joey. Mike Moustakis out of 50. 40 of 50 on the Moustakis going to the Reds. Also to Joey. Pittsburgh Pirates. Nice break. Cabrian Hayes out of 199. Jared Oliva Auto and Cabrian Hayes Short Print. Pirates to Jeff Gillespie. Oh, this is a super short print. I just checked it out on the back side because I thought it was kind of weird that we actually had two short prints in one. This is a 442 auto. So you got a super short print here on the uh, Cabrian Hayes. That's awesome. Uh, next one right away, Michael. We got some uh, collegiate draft picks. Prism. And last but not least, Alfonso Soriano. 172 out of 199. The Yankees going to rob. Pirates. Jeff Gillespie. Big hit on the Cabrera Hayes. If I would have looked on the back and noticed that that was the, the super short print, I would probably have put that in the mitt. That's a big hit there, Jeff. Good stuff. All right, my friends, that will do it. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's an art, Charlie. <laughs> All right, my friends, that'll do it for 2021 Series 2 for the night. I'll be back in a few short minutes with number two Prism draft picks. Uh, so, And then after that, we got a personal case for Nick Sartell. Thanks a bunch. Thanks a bunch, Joe. All right, see you soon, everybody. Bye-bye.